Hey everyone, Squee here. Welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim. So, I think I am going to uh, what now? tell her to wait here. Oh, you're off on your own for a while? Alright. And uh, I'll have Freya stay with her. Uh, we're going to stay here for a while. So you can just stay here. Alright, Freya will stay here to protect Serana. And uh, I'm going to go hunt for information. I'm also going to stop by the store and sell some stuff. But uh, my main goal is to hunt for information. Since I have to do that during the day... What? Are you kidding me? Oh, joy! What time is it even? Oh, it's 8 p.m. Somebody help! Right. Yeah! Oh, I don't want to fight another dragon. Whoa. No, not the dog! Not the dog! Ow. Ow. Potions. Uh... I don't remember if I told you guys or not, I removed the, uh... The dragon overhaul mod uh, a while ago because it was just getting ridiculous. I think I told you that. There we go. Bam. Okay. Uh oh. Okay, here it comes. <laughs> Majestic arrows, Justic Car Saber, huh? I can sell it. Okay, you can't run anymore. No. Oh, the puppy. You, you took its very soul. Yeah, I know. No. I've never seen such a thing. He was so brave. It's really dead then. He tried to defend everyone. Oh. My God, I don't even know what to say. Well, he doesn't deserve to stay here. Let me go bury him. Oh, that's so sad. We brought him here and found him a home, and then he died protecting that home from a dragon. Oh. Okay. Uh, we'll just say that he buried him. Ali, I need to give you some stuff because I am over loaded. Right. Um. Take like two of those. There we go. Thank you. Well, we'll rest here for the night then, because obviously I need to go talk to people during the day, and I need to go sell stuff during the day and all that stuff. So let's go ahead and get a room. Hello. Fate is the name. I keep the inn. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Thank you. Let's sate that appetite. Hmm? All right, let me get some food. Chicken breast, mead, apple pie. 
There we go. I'll show you to your room. Uh, eat. There we go. Right this way. Let me know if there's anything else you need. All right, I'll just sleep until tomorrow morning. So what we'll do is we'll sleep, uh, we'll rest here. I'll go get information tomorrow and go sell stuff and all that. And then we'll head out. I think there's a blacksmith shop here. I might be absolutely wrong on that. We should probably, because I'm getting low on arrows too, probably make a, a trip by solitude. Fate is the name. I keep the inn. You two stay here. I'm going to go uh, hunt for information. I might actually make a quick jaunt up to solitude to sell stuff. We'll leave them down here. Is there a blacksmith shop? Lumber. Outpost. House. House. Yeah, so I, don't, I guess there aren't any shops here. Okay, there. Actually, let's go ahead and get. Okay, back to the world map. So, yeah, I might make a quick jaunt up to. Uh, solitude. Have you met my husband? Well, don't bother. He's a drunk. Okay, you know anything about a moth priest visiting Dragon Bridge? Nah, I don't think so. Okay, then. Until then. How about you, sir? Seen some mean-spirited folk pass through lately. Thought I was rid of those sorts when I left Markarth. I have potatoes to sell? Honest pay for honest work. D think, think, what? <laughs> hey, moth priest, Dragon Bridge. A moth priest? I'm sorry, but I don't know anything about that. Try asking one of the guards. Uh, okay, I will. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, sir. We need to do something about these vampire attacks. Have you seen anything of Moth Priest Dragon Bridge stuff? Ah, so that was a Moth Priest then. He rode through town not long ago with an escort of soldiers. They didn't stop, just headed south across the Dragon Bridge. South, huh? Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I'm gonna run up to Solitude real quick. While they stay at the end. Oh, Milo. Such a coward. Um, I forget which path I need to take. I need, think I need to take the bottom one. Yeah. A little jittering there. Um, I know we get, I get a little bit of uh, stuttering when I run on Alley, um, but overall, uh, since I removed the uh, the mods, the you know extra graphical mods and stuff. I think the game has been running a lot better. And it looks, as far as I can tell, looks pretty much the same. The rocks may not be quite as sharp and detailed as they once were before, but I think we'll survive that. I really do. All right. Hmm? So. All right, so we'll sell all the stuff we can, then we'll head back down, grab our companions, and once it hits nightfall, we will go hunting for the Moth Priest. Yep. That is definitely what we're going to do. <laughs> I'm going to quiz you guys, but you have no real way of answering, so... I'll just say that I quizzed you guys and you all passed the flying colors. Good for you. Good job. I've got a little work if you're interested, travelers. I'm not interested.
got something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any. Beeren said you got here just before the ex. Oh, uh, a bit of this yeah, and right. a bit of that. Um, you don't have much gold, do you? All right. Well, let's see what I can sell you. I don't want to sell you that, actually. I can sell you that. Sell you those two. There we go. Done. Uh, do you have anything for me to buy? Probably not. A bowl? <gasps> you have a bowl? No. Maybe the... that thing? The... the... soul gem. Couldn't think of what I wanted to say. Definitely. Definitely. I'll take those. Right. Take those. Sorrow die okay. Okay, no. Well you got lots of gold now, so let's sell the rest of this stuff, shall we? There we go. Um don't need that. Okay. Ooh, you don't have enough for that. I'll sell you that empty soul gem. Don't have enough for those. You have enough for that, and that's about it. You know what? Let me go ahead and get the, uh, cause yeah, I think I don't have a lot of, oh, I have common. Okay. So yeah, we're good. Come back to bits and pieces anytime. Yep. Um, I'm going to go to, oh, this, uh, jewelry lady over here, and then I'll go to the blacksmith. Jewelry slash clothes. It's a shame Serana doesn't uh, see the vampire curse as a curse. Be kind of nice to heal her. She seems like a nice person. Hate to think I'd have to kill her one day because she's trying to eat people. Oh, what delight! Another clothes and raiment for the discerning customer. You just customer. get charming, more and more charming by the day. You know that. Hey, look at that. All right, uh, anything else? Lots of other stuff. Nothing you can afford, though. Anything I want? Yeah, I already have. Ring of Archery. Ring of Stamina. Might actually be worth it. Maybe. No. Fine. I think it's time to maybe start stockpiling up some of my money. You never know when I might need a large treasure trove. Or whatever. Wow, 
Hi, guards. Was there a guard convention or something you guys are just coming from? Pardon me. Seems there's no end to the needs of him. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage? Right. What will you buy from me? Let's take a look at this first. Uh, you can have those. You can have that one. I don't even care. Can I have that? Okay, what about armor? Nice. Anything else? No. Okay. Um, what about, what do you have? Let's see here. I need ebony boots for Freya, but he doesn't have any of those. Class bow of blaze, huh? 62 plus 25 points of damage. Actually, that blaze might actually be really good against vampires. Uh, we'll see. Okay, Chengdao. Um. All right, that glass bow of blaze. 62 plus 25, so 87. Not any 87. Uh, whoa. Okay. Um, bow of blizzard is 54 plus 25. I might just sell you and take the blaze. Because that'll be much more helpful against frost trolls and vampires and pretty much everything else. And you need all. So let's do Wanderer that. Wanderer like you must have. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. All right. So let's sell the bow of blizzards. And let's buy the glass bow of blaze. There we go. Ooh, a helm of water breathing. All right, so my ebony bow is 75 damage. The glass bow is only 62, but with 25, so that's 87. You know, there's not a huge difference there. We're talking about an extra 12 points of damage, but that's still an extra 12 points of damage. So, and always wear your armor. Now let's go get some arrows, shall we? an extra 12 damage plus if you hit him with a sneak attack then you talk about an extra 36 damage which could be the difference between the one-shot kill or not hello and welcome my friend bows and arrows for the mighty huntsman all right what do you got here <laughs> glass blow of blizzards just a car arrows thank you what other kind of arrows do you have? What? What? You only got one? You only got one. Oh man. Oh, I should probably get some of you. Oh man, I want lots of those. <laughs> I want so many of those. Ornate Khajiit Bow. Alright. Perhaps I'll be seeing more of you. Maybe. 
So now I've got 70 Justicar and 73. Okay, I should be fine. All right, back to the inn. Um, okay, so here's what we'll do, because I, I know we're coming up on the end of the episode. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop recording here, and then I will head uh, back to the inn. Watch what you're doing. And uh, when nightfall comes, we'll pick up the trail. So, we'll see you guys then. Bye.